What's up guys, Danny from Project Performance here, and today we got something a little bit special for you. We got a 2015 supercharged JK here that we're gonna be removing the supercharger and installing one of our stage two turbo kits. But before, of course, we're gonna get our preliminary dyno numbers, see what kind of power and torque she's currently making. And uh, we're also gonna take a look at power bands and uh, how they differentiate from supercharger versus turbocharger. So uh, stick around for this one. You're definitely not gonna wanna miss it. We just read the file out. We just made two changes to the uh, transmission control module. We changed the speed at which it will upshift and the speed at which it will downshift. That's the only change we made. So now we're just gonna come in here. We can plug a couple things, see what kind of gear ratio this vehicle has. Real simple. Speedometer, 373, that's how the vehicles are currently equipped. Let's see if someone bothered to program the tires, tire 635, so yeah. I didn't program anything there. I'm gonna traction control off. Okay, now we'll just get the speed on the dyno. Now we'll break down for the vehicle. So yeah, the boost comes in here nice and linear. So if you like seven pounds of boost, you better drive that bitch over here at uh, 6,200 RPMs. <laughs> 6,200 RPMs. I mean, that ain't cool. But if you like, you know. But maybe, I don't know, whatever. That's not the point here. So like our turbo system will pretty much make um, all the boost here somewhere in this range. So you have seven pounds, make three times the boost half the time. So how does that work? So anyway, here's the torque. I don't know what's going on with it. It was like, yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, uh. Oh, not very. All right, so we can change this one back over here. All the scaling, everything's the same as everything we do. So as always here, the torque line has little dots on it. So the torque scales on the right side, the horsepower scales on the left side, and yeah. So like 6,200 RPMs, it made 260 horsepower. So this car will make roughly what stock? 215, 220, something like that? We've seen 236. We have seen 230, so we'll give them a benefit of 220. 220, so that's 40 horsepower. So, I'm not sure. So if we go, divided by, what it makes, seven point something pounds? Seven pounds, you know. That's 5.7 horsepower per pound to boost. Yeah, not so, not very efficient power adder there. But um, anyway, I would like to show the AFR, to be all fairness, but it blew it out the tailpipe. So I'm going to uh, just run it back. And then I think in all fairness, we can send this, the data log from the, from the run, send a tune file from the run, and maybe a screenshot of what the AFR does here, see if they want to modify the um, tune at all or see if there's something wrong with the one this vehicle has received. I'm not sure, I think it's fair to do. Again, not a critique on basically the company, but this is an Intrepical Supercharger Model A available on the market. So, 
We ran the green run. Here it is here at roughly 3,500 RPMs. Makes 157 horsepower. And it does make roughly 210 foot pounds of torque at 3,500. Okay, so we ran it. We noticed the squiggly lines here. Maybe indicator of the tune. I did record the air fuel ratio on the first run, which is the green run. However, the tailpipe sniffer fell out in the run, so it didn't show. So we ran it again, back to back. There's the pink one. Did the same thing, actually got a little hotter, so it made a little less power. But um, go back over here, and let's turn on the air fuel ratio and see what it does. So green one tip, the thing fell out, so it's just pegged at the top. But look at this, it's off the charts, Rich, buried, nine to one. I mean, so yeah, nine to one. So it, it um, definitely has a tuning problem here. Rich, for some reason, not sure. Would certainly love to contact the manufacturer of the force induction system, and provide all the information we have here, and probably unbiasedly just make sure that the vehicle's running on the current tune. They'd like us to check anything, diagnose anything, follow any steps so that we're not misleading any information we provide, we'd be happy to do so. So we'll send that over to them now. I'll turn the, cur the curses off so it looks a little larger, but the results are kind of the same. Um, I like torque, torque here. So, yeah.